lovely people, welcome back. So today we're going to do my covenant post. I was waiting for a good time. My old recording stopped out on me, but Mystic Vision gave me four items, so I'm gonna jump in, try some covenant pulls. This is the second time ever Guardian Gazelle's been featured, and anybody that knows me knows she's been my number one most wanted hero in this game for like several years now. And even to this day with her costume, she would be usable. So I'm going to try as hard as I possibly can to pull her. And I didn't tape my Contest of Element Fire pulls. I did like 40-some. It was horrible. The only thing I got was Baldur, who already gotten faded. So not since the Alucard run, haven't seen anything special. Now these three pulls were from completing the quest. i probably going to try to get the gem offers this time because ideally I want to do a 30 pull if I haven't pulled Gazelle by then. Oh. I mean, I know it's unlikely, but it's just... Mm. I tried so hard when she was featured in Challenge Festival. And there are, I mean, other good options. The only other one... The only one I have is Archie. And so obviously that'd be awful. I, while the art on this one's good, she's not going to probably be that great. Unfortunately, they kind of nerfed her since beta. She had silence. They took that away, and at fast speeds, basically just a fancy sniper. Quinn would be my first elemental hero. I don't love him. I have enough ice heroes, but I mean, he's a good support hero healer. Cardinal Richelieu, I think, would be the second best one to get besides Gazelle for me. And just in general, one of the most recent really released. You know, got the stealing buffs, fiends. Can be fun. Gilak for mana control. Again, I'm not... I'm more well off in ice, so it's not as much of a priority, but another new released hero. So basically, four of them would be at least good. And two would be phenomenal for me. Basically, just seeing a lot of season one here, though. I waited till Mystic Vision gave me four items, just like I've been waiting for several hours now. It's seven o'clock. Portal's been open for seven and a half hours. This is my first opportunity, but. Not that great that I don't know if I want to get the rest of my pulls for today yet. So, I'll check back later. I keep waiting and waiting for a good time to pull. I've been using summons tokens, mystic vision, and it's been like over a day. I haven't had a single good sign. So, I've kind of had it. I kind of want to give it a shot. Did my three free pulls. Got some offers, but... I plan on pulling quite a bit here to hopefully land Gazelle. Colonel Richelieu would be a solid consolation, but I don't know. I don't think I'd be satisfied unless I got Gazelle. I think I got Gazelle. I could end the game tomorrow with satisfaction, I suppose. She's the only hero I've ever like consistently just wanted across time. She hasn't wavered. She's been my number one for several years. Mahegan's a good sign. I'm gonna... I haven't been getting a sign from the game, but maybe... Maybe we can get some luck anyway. Alright, I have 21 here. I have several more offers I could get. There's 10 pulls for $10 on the webpage that I'll probably get. At least that. I'm not gonna do them all if things are not looking good, though. Learn, learn my lesson. Last year I had horrible luck. I've had horrible luck most of the time, but this year I think it's been better. Maybe it's just been better straight up, but maybe the fact that I break it up helps improve my success. Because if you keep pulling when it's clearly not favoring you, rarely has turned out well in my favor, at least. But I'm seeing monster hunters, which is a good sign. Covenant hasn't mm, been good to me lately. Last year I pulled was Ferris the first time he was featured. And oddly enough, I've n never pulled a non-monster hunter from Covenant except once as for a featured, was Frida. Most Covenant, may, most Covenant quests are Covenant portals. I usually want a non-monster hunter and I get monster hunters always of the featured. Literally every single time except for once, and that was a dupe. So it feels unlikely that I even pull Gazelle because she is not a monster hunter. 
it's probably likely I pulled the blue or the purple one if I pull a five star, which, I mean, it's not a horrible thing. The blue guy's good. He's not amazing, but he's good. And the purple, I don't think is going to be very good. I don't know. She just got hit by a nerf before she got released. And she's one of those heroes that might be good defensively, and ugh, I don't care about that. Okay, so four more, probably. Open up one more chest, at least. Gazelle? No. It's not. Quinn would be my first elemental hero. Cardinal Ridgely would be my first, like, good musketeer. Because I have Porthos and Queen Anne, the two worst. Mm, I have Archie. That would be, like, the worst result, other than, like, an unfeatured. Gazelle! Oh. <laughs> Two more. At least I get to open a chest. Blue. Valen. Ugh. Two season ones back to back is a good sign to quit anyway. So last one. Mm, three season ones. Yeah, for sure quit. And this is... Oh, I got some food, I guess. I was gonna say it's a shitty chest, but that's okay. I'll check back later. Ugh. Frustrating. Waiting for the perfect time. Pull my gazelle. Finally, I see four items. I've been waiting for that. So let's jump in for my third try at landing Gazelle. But this, I mean, it's been two days and that was the first time I've gotten four items. So let's see. I mean, it doesn't always work, but since I don't have daily summons tokens, I find it's the best secondary method to use for those of us who rely on little cheats or mm, clues. I mean, it's, again unlikely to guarantee a favorable result but it's a bonus and who wouldn't want any advantage they can get now after all these it'll be about 30 pulls average person needs to do about 40 to see a five star in this portal and i estimate i might get to like 80 90 by the end of this which should see two five stars and at least one featured for that on average the average person could always get luckier but we all know you can always be unlucky too. Be below odds. Ooh, want a gazelle for so many years. Uh, she came out in like 2019, I think it was. And I remember playing with her in beta and just like falling in love with her. And it's never had any luck. Challenge events used to only have 1% odds too and share the odds with like four other five stars. So I mean, then it was impossible. But. I think it was last year she was featured for the first time with her costume. I don't know how long it's been, but it's less than a year a year. <sighs> Gosh, she would make my month. The only hero I can think of that I've been like, I think will improve my gameplay, but also just like, I don't know. The only hero That'll change it significantly enough, I guess, to get excited about. Of course, everybody likes getting new heroes, especially, like, coveted ones, but Gazelle is one that is a whole unique special skill that hasn't been really replicated elsewhere. And, of course, I don't have Odette. There are some close seconds, but... Three more. If I don't see anything good, I gotta stop, because, like, I had hoped... That was a good sign, but not always. See, it's not as great as the summons token method, too, because you have to use, like, three pulls before you go in for your your big summoning event thing. So, I mean, it's pretty back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back if you have that much luck. I mean, hopefully you should see something. <laughs> it was yellow. Every time it's yellow, I get, I get a little excited. Okay. One more, and then I'm over 20 pulls in. Nothing. So far. Blue? No. Before I hop off, let me just check here. I don't see I don't have any. Oh, two star. Ugh. I hate when that happens. It's like uh, kinda halfway. Since I feel like I've been waiting for this moment, I'm gonna keep Oh. I already had Utherogan. I think this is my third. But tomorrow is another day with more pulls and I'm about to go to bed, so 
And I still have a couple offers I could get today, but we'll see. And I wanted to see what the results of this would help me make my decision. Gazelle? Oh, oh, that stupid Sally tricking me. Queen, Gazelle, and Cardinal Richelieu, please. Five more. See, I maybe should have stopped at that 10 mark, but it's hard to tell. Ugh. I hate when I see season one, though. It's like, it feels like everything's just going to go down the crapper after that. Ugh, wow. Disappointing, but still 10 more polls before... The average person will have seen a five star and after that then I'm starting to get below odds and seeing an unfavorable result and it's although starting off bad doesn't mean it's gonna be bad it usually does end up being that I don't pull anything so I'm a little worried now <laughs> this is the second time maybe the last time gazelle will be featured so because challenge festival they're only featuring new costumes with a new hero and then one hero who seems to be hippo it seems like hippo is just the other fill-in so i don't know i guess we'll see i'll check back later all right here we go again mystic vision first mystic vision of the day gave me something so it's still day two but i was going to at least buy one of these and we'll see how that goes I do have another Mystic Vision. Sometimes I watch them back to back to see if they're consistent, but eh, I was already going to get this, so let's see. Two more days left. I haven't seen anything yet, and by the end of these, it'll be about four pulls, which average person will see in a five star. Am I going to be average? Am I going to be below average? Am I going to be above average? What do we think? Gazelle is all I want. Uh, it's gonna take some luck for me to get her. It's insane that you can spend a couple hundred and not get anything in this game. I think that's insane to me. Let alone to get your the one hero you want. I mean that's like a thousand thousands of dollars just for one hero. This is wild. Sometimes I think about it and it's like, wow, can't Ugh. but here we are. No, I've never chased, chased a hero till I got what I wanted, but the best you, I do is save and throw what I can. There's a lot of green happening here. I don't like that, because green is literally the only color I can't get anything new in. I think this is going to be 41 pulls-ish. I don't know. Exactly. It's about halfway from what I expect to do, like 90, I think, ish. I don't know. It might change, but around that number, 80, 90, 100, who knows. Two more. Gazelle. Gazelle. Green. Goddamn green. Numb skull. Last one. This is not looking good. Gato again? Well, I suppose I'll wait. Try again later, but I am below odds now. We're starting to be about, yeah, below odds. But it could change. If I pull a five star, then I'm about average. If I pull two, I'm above. So give it time. Not that many pulls in, so check back later. All right, and here we go again for the four or fifth time. Haven't landed a five star yet. Odds suggest I should have seen something by now, so hopefully in the next eight pulls. Fingers crossed. And ideally a featured gazelle. Cardinal Richelieu. Then probably Quinn and then Kelac. The other two, Archie I would hate. I have two of him already. Unfeatured hero I would hate. Hero of the month, whatever. That's not what I'm here for. And Tenebrae I'd be the least excited about, but I mean Kind of raise at least a, a kind of win. Be a disappointing win, but better than other results. 
could get like Val in here. And the Aether quest thing is here. I have enough to do a temple, so I'll do that in one of these videos. Probably when I feel luckier. Like, I just, this entire covenant, I haven't had a moment where it's like, oh yeah, like, let's pull now. It's Mystic Vision has mostly been giving me crap, and four items is fine, but when the, I had a Mystic Vision previous to that, that was only three, so it already didn't feel that great, but I figured I'd give it a shot anyway. But this is probably the last chunk of pulls I'm going to do today. And on the final day, I'll have a lot to go through. Because there will be the 10 pulls for $10 offer. There will be coin offers in-game that I'll probably get. And then I have my gems, which I considered I might save up to do a full 30 pull in this. Or I might do just a couple 10s. I'm just shy of doing a second 10, but I will probably at least get enough for that. I don't know. Again, it's all dependent on like how I'm feeling. This game is giving me gazelle. <laughs> God damn it. But, been really exciting. It, I mean, it was cool to finally pull Alucard, who I was so excited to pull, but like really tried last year, like insane. But gazelle, I've tried most of any hero that I could. I guess she hasn't been featured enough to seem like I'm trying that much, but it's the main reason I'm still pulling uh, Challenge Festival, even though, like, I have half of the costumes and the other half, like, I, there's many I would love, but, and I would love Anne, it's just, they never feature them, and it's unlikely I pull them unfeatured. Like, last time I pulled Jabberwock, who I already have. Oh, it was so frustrating. So I'm kind of having, I've been having a lot of that though. Besides Alucard and that little run of luck, like that was actual luck. Been a lot of disappointments that either I have been below odds and not pulling anything, or I do pull something and it's like a dupe or a hero you don't want. It's just so frustrating. Cause uh... Oh my god, that's like my fourth one. Hmm. <laughs> This is the last pull of the day. Uh, purple. Merlin. Very disappointing. I'm now well over 40 pulls. I have to add it up, but I'm getting closer to 50. Not a single 5 star yet. I don't count here of the month because that's a bonus draw that's its own separate odds. And that can happen in any portal. But this specific... With 2.5%, you should see a 5 star approximately every 40 pulls. And with 1.6 featured, that's like 60 to 70 pulls for one of these guys. Now, I haven't hit that mark yet, so it's not crazy, but I will hit that mark before this video ends. So, let's see if I can at least get one. Alright, I'll check back with y'all tomorrow. Alright, y'all. I'm tired of waiting for the perfect moment. It is the last day, so it's not like I have all the time in the world. My Mystic Visions are not giving me that great of things. This is the second time I've tried today, so... And I have to wait two hours between. But I have, like, two, three, four summoning sessions. I got the $10, 10 pulls for $10 offer, the last one, on the webpage. But I'll also, I'm sure, get these ones to get some more coins, and at the very end, if I haven't pulled anything desirable, I might throw, I don't know, either two temples or a 30 pull out. I do have enough to do two tens right now, but I might get another offer to do that full 30. I don't do 30s very often, and I'm saving it to the end because I could use it for Black Friday, although I'm not really looking forward to Black Friday. I participated in the last four, and all four of them have treated me badly versus what's expected. So it's not an event that ever likes me, and it's an expensive event. I've Every time I've saved to do over 200 pulls in each, and I haven't gotten anything more rewarding than two five stars, two new five stars from it. So I don't know. I haven't... I'm not sure now. There's so many events now, so many portals to spend in or save coins for, use even gems in, that I don't know if it's worth it. Especially no costumes. So, anyway. I'm kind of not looking forward to this because I'm I'm afraid I'm not going to get anything. And that's going to put me in a, like, a ugh, sour hating the game mood. And that's the thing that's so frustrating about this game is 
every new portal, you can get lucky once, but another one comes in that you're looking forward to, and it can really, like, turn your past wins into a little bit sour, because you throw a lot at it and don't get anything. Like, that's a disappointing experience. But, I mean, I've done plenty. I should have seen a 5-star by now, so... I saw 130 pull that had all four of the heroes that I want. Like, had Gilak, Cardinal Richard, Gazelle, and Quinn. Is that his name, Quinn? Yeah, all four of them in a single 30 pull. Like, how crazy is... Good for them, though. Seriously. Like, that is, like, dream-level shit. Like, missing out on the two that I don't care about, at least. I don't know about them, but... Anyway, so I usually would wait for Mystic Vision or Daily Summons to give me something that's like, ooh, maybe I'm lucky. This is a decent sign, though. Two Monster Hunters. Because there's not specific odds for the Monster Hunters. I don't know if that makes it lucky or not, but it seems luckier. <laughs> I just hate when these videos last throughout the whole portal that I have to post at the very end, because then it's like, the event's over, who gives a shit, you know? People are usually more interested in what's going on now, but to share the entirety of my experience, I feel like I have to. So many trainer heroes. I wonder if they're you're more likely to get the trainer heroes, like if it's more than 50%. So I feel like I get trainer heroes more than food. Like I've never seen it full of food, but I've seen it full of trainer heroes. And I don't feel like I've really gotten many like mats from it. I don't know if you can or if you do, but... Do see food and see trainer heroes. I think I've seen a small aether. Is that right? Maybe it's in a different one. I don't know. I get things confused. There's so many portals and so many chests and Oh god! Finally a five star! Oh god. Okay, that didn't the screenshot failed. Finally, it's a monster hunter again. Like I said, it would happen, Gazelle. God damn it! Ugh. But at least. I got the 5 star some average, and it's a 5 star I can make use of. It's not the best ones, or even like top 3, but it's number 4, so it's not bad. But, ugh, not getting Gazelle isn't just, there's nothing that'll be like, y'all know, anybody that knows me knows I've been after this goddamn Gazelle. <laughs> so, ugh. Uh. But, I mean, I think he's good. He's not, I don't think he's great. At average speed, only affects three. It's like an Onatel, an up-to-date Onatel. And Onatel's good, but she's not amazing now anymore. And so, in that sense, I'm not super excited. Again, blue is one of my better colors, too. And that's why Cardinal originally or Gazelle would be just better for my roster. But mana control can be amazing. I don't. I do have some in blue already. See, that's the thing. It's just blue is, I think, my best color right now. Breaking it down. Green might be. I don't know. But it's it's something. Now, I'm going to, since we just saw luck, sometimes some people would say to stop there. I'm going to test that out. We're going to get this and see if I'm still lucky. Because why not? I only have today to do these pulls anyway. Might as well try while I just saw luck to see if it's, if it'll continue. If it doesn't in these eight poles, we'll check back later. Carnal Ridgelo, Gazelle. Gazelle. But it's seriously always monster hunters. That's why I would love to get Gazelle because it would break that cycle of only pulling monster hunters in the Covenant portal, which is a good problem to have. I'll argue that because a lot of people, I'm sure that's because this is the only place to get them, but. For me, it's like I'm always focused on some other hero because, like, I've had time to covet them. New heroes are great, but you don't know how they're going to affect the meta. You don't know. You've had time to, you know, build a wand for them. So it just doesn't feel uh, the same, I guess. Like, is that it's been years? It's been years. And several attempts at her, whereas some other heroes, especially the Monster Hunters, like, that's the first shot. It's great if you get them, but... See, trainer heroes. Four stars good, but so many trainer heroes. It feels like Gazelle. I mean, I would have rather pulled the Gaelock than Archie. Obviously, I have Archie, but the purple too. Cause, oh, 
And I suppose the purple's in most likely because it's a monster hunter. I swear it's like my my account's tagged for that or something. Mahegan. I mean, seeing good results-ish, like Monster Hunters, not season one, things like that. Quinn? Jot. Jot's so big. Anything but Gazelle, I'm just gonna always have a tinge of disappointment, though. Gazelle? Uh, <laughs> Sally and her fuckery. Okay, well, I do still have one more of the daily offers, and then a final attempt at might come with some pulls to get gems if I do that. The thing is, 10 pulls, and especially 30 pulls, make me nervous because it's just that one moment. And if you're not lucky in that one moment, all of that money and gems it's basically goes to waste. And I've been disappointed more than I've been excited about my gem pulls. Like, I've gotten nothing more times than gotten something. And I'd suggest a 30 pull, it's about 50-50. You should see a 5-star in... I would say I can only, like, I can count on my hands how many times I've gotten just a single 5-star from a 30. Like, that's, and I've played this game for 5 years. Like, that's, it's bad. So, I'm a little bit jaded that, and it makes me nervous. But, I get to Gazelle, so I might try. Now that I have two of the featured, it's a bit riskier, but I'll check back with you guys later. Alright? Wish me luck. See you then. Alright, well, I'm going to try my last bit of coin pulls before I make the dive into maybe using my gems as I got the last remaining covenant offers. And that gave me 9 pulls for $12. Not the best deal, but they don't offer many on the webpage. Now, I do realize I still got that to do, too. I'm doing these pulls before I go to bed really quick. Ugh, not the best sign there. I don't know, maybe I'll make the Aether Summon if I do the gem summons. I mean, I can do a 10 pull, but I just, I hate to use it now when I'm not feeling lucky. I've only ever pulled two Alpha Aethers total from this portal, despite doing, like, several of these 30s. I don't spend for it, but saving up to do a 10 each time. Did I say 30? I'm confusing my words here. But now I'm not even married to the idea of using gems here. I don't know. I'm just so feeling so defeated. I, I'm about average. Pulled a 5 star, and it was a new one, but it's just, oh, gazelle. She would change my gameplay and make it more exciting for me. So it's, she's just the only hero that really would do that that's different enough. That would Every hero is very similar to another in that way that Gazelle is unique. That's why I want her so much. So I really could use a little spice in the gameplay. But I'll do a couple here. Nothing. Which I'm assuming nothing. And then I'll go to bed and probably wake up before the portal closes. And maybe we'll do some then. Quinn would be great at least because he'd be my new elemental hero. Not wouldn't be gazelle level, but probably this Cardinal Rich would be second best simply because he's red. But like very close. Colin, ooh, seeing a season one, a good sign, not a good sign. I don't love that gazelle. Let's put gazelle. Yeah, how about you guys? Seven pulls. I'm just not not feeling lucky from right now. I'd actually be surprised probably to pull a five star, but I need to separate my pulls somewhat, and I don't want to do them all when I wake up, because if I'm not lucky then, then it's really... Oh, that always sucks. Cardinal Richelieu. No, but Basil. I don't... I already have all the three stars, four stars, just after five stars here. Just after featured, actually. Just after four out of six of the featured, with one only being like the big win, which is just like insane odds. <laughs> so when I think of that, it's like, okay, yeah, you're probably not gonna pull her. I mean, I'm after this, I think it's about 76 pulls, I think it was, I counted total, in that the average person will see about two five stars. And if I do the 30 pull, that's just over 100, maybe 115 at total. And again, that's not even enough to guarantee anything. I mean, at that, probably be average or lucky to see three or four of the featured or any five stars, really. So, I mean, that's unfortunate because that's a lot. But even that's not enough. And when Gazelle was featured, 
That's damn Sally. I tried, I think, over 100. I know I tried really hard. That was hard. First time I actually said goodbye to her several times, but that one I had hope for because she was. that was the first time she was featured, so I was like, really like, eh, I mean, you can do this, Randa. I did pull Hippo, and Hippo ended up being a game changer and really fun, so that helped. I don't think Gilak is that. But what can you do? Hey, Gazelle. What's up? Why do you hate me so much? What did I ever do? I just want to be your friend. Gato, yo. Uh, last one. Red. Okay, well, I guess I'll check back later, possibly. It's not looking great for me, but I'd suggest I should see another featured, hopefully, by the end of this, at least. One more. Can it be Gazelle? I'd love to get lucky, but we're just going to go average now. Fingers crossed, fingers crossed. <sighs> Alright, here we are for the final chunk of this video. I just woke up, like, 20 minutes ago. There's four minutes left. We're just going to jump right in. Got enough for a temple, but I also have 10 pulls, 11 pulls here to get through. And I waited till the final moments. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! I did it! It worked! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! I can't believe that just happened on my first pull. I don't have to use my gems. I'm like... I'm like literally teary-eyed. I've been waiting for it, that moment. I can't believe it was the first pull. Like, I just jumped on here. I didn't open my Mystic Vision. I just went in here because I'm like, oh, fuck, I don't have time. Did that happen? Did that happen? I don't know. I don't know. I could have. I mean, I haven't even had my coffee yet. She's like the one of the only heroes that... I mean, there's always a hero I covet, but you know, when you get him, you realize it's just a little bit different than someone you have, which, oh my god, I can't believe that just happened. That was the first hero I pulled that was new off the feature that wasn't a goddamn monster hunter too. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. I always dreamed of this moment. I thought I'd drop my phone. I thought it'd, f like, I, 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 see, the thing is, like, I feel it kind of, but then when I rewatch the video, it's like, okay, yeah, that shit happens. Like, you know, you play those little scenarios of it actually happening in your head, but it doesn't. And so, you know, you kind of, it doesn't really feel like reality. I feel like I should be freaking out, and I'm going to freak out, probably more off screen than you're going to see. The first pull, I all these gems I get to save, like... I can't remember a time where I didn't have to use everything I had. Like, that always happens, and then I still get nothing. Um, did that. It's like, it hurt. Oh, my, please. Oh, my God. See, I got these, thinking, like, I'm going to have to do a 30 pull. I'm going to have to do all this. And sure, I didn't get Quinn or Cardinal Richelieu, but Gazelle was all I wanted. And the thing is, too, I had considered this last night. I had Edwin and Azure Matt go into 70, right? And I had my purple, red, and yellow waiting. I did my purple and red, and I'm like, I didn't want to do my yellow, because, like, what if I pull Gazelle? I don't know. I would rather, you know, bring her up right away. But, you know, I figured I'm not going to pull fucking Gazelle. I never pull Gazelle. And here, you can see, I literally, all I did was Mac, or raise Zuzhlu up one you know, ascend him, and didn't even feed him. Specifically, just like, uh, you know, sometimes the game's fucking, you know, vindictive like that. Oh my god. Oh my god! I am so excited. And now, that my wish, this is like the biggest wish of this game for me. It's complete. I have to go and join an alliance and start to, like, play a little bit more because I gotta savor this. And I gotta get my gazelle good use, so. Yeah. I was gonna do a 30 pull and put my hat on and make you guys watch, but not today. I'll save my 30 pull gems for, I don't know, Black Friday? Unless 
Pickup signs actually treated me okay with Ruby. They'd have to have two amazing featured. I hate that portal. <sighs> That's the only other gem only portal I would use my gems on. So I guess we'll see. But probably Black Friday, even though I'm not excited about that. <sighs> oh my god. I hope you guys have had luck to unfold your dream hero. If not, I hope it's right around the corner. Trust me, right before all this, I had shit luck. But I'm basically, that was average. That wasn't above odds. It was above odds in getting two featured and two different featured. And the fact that they were featured that were new to me. And it's Atlantis now and I was totally going in like thinking, oh fuck, I don't even want to farm. And I don't even, I spent a lot trying to get these heroes. I don't know if I'm going to be summoning much this week or next week, but we'll see. We'll see. But I'm going to upload this so you guys can... I can forever immortalize the moment I got Gazelle, but also to share with you, but I just don't want it to seem, because I've only been posting the last two videos for good luck. I haven't been taping a lot of my bad luck, but uh, it hasn't been great for me before this. So just FYI, even though this might distort your reality or how, what it takes to pull a five star, trust me, it still sucks for all of us, at least special. Me too. Okay. I'm going to, I'm going to stop. Save in this moment. You can let me know how your Covenant pulls, your Atlantis pulls, your Goblin pulls, your... What else was last week? Your War Three Kingdoms and Underwild and all that shit. Just let me know how that's been going for you or how you've been. I know I don't always reply, but I do read your guys' comments. So I'd love to hear from you. And hopefully I'll put out some video soon. You never know with me, but I'm sure I'm not done. So, All right, my lovely people. Thank you for watching. See you guys in the next video. Hope you all have a great rest of your weekend. If you have a weekend left. And great start to your week. See you then. Oh my god.